automated vehicles have the potential to save thousands of lives annually and improve the quality of life through reduction of traffic congestion, increased productivity, and environmental benefits as well. AVs would restore also mobility for millions of people who face transportation challenges, such as the elderly or the disabled. In 2017, the U.S. Department of Transportation provided voluntary guidelines on the development of automated vehicles. It was called Automated Driving Systems 2.0, A Vision for Safety. And in the following year, the department actually addressed AV developments across all surface transportation modes. And that is because the developments and technology in this field was happening so quickly. So we came out with AV 3.0. Basically, it's entitled Preparing for the Future of Transportation, Automated Vehicles 3.0. And today, I am pleased to announce the release of AV 4.0, ensuring American leadership in automated vehicle technologies. AV 4.0 is a joint White House and U.S. Department of Transportation initiative and the takeaway from AV 4.0 is that the federal government is all in for safer, better, and more inclusive transportation, aided by automated driving systems. AV 4.0 unifies AV efforts across 38 different federal agencies and departments, and independent agencies, and commissions, and executive office of the president. You get the drift. This document and set of guidelines recognizes the value of private sector leadership in AV research, development, and integration. This kind of innovation requires appropriate government oversight to ensure safety, open markets, strategic allocation, of public resources, and of course, protection of the public interest. But realizing the vast potential of AVs will require collaboration and information sharing among industry partners, state and local governments, academia, nonprofits, standards development organizations, and of course, the 38 different federal government agencies, independent commissions, departments. So AV 4.0 will inform this collaborative effort in automated vehicles for all stakeholders and outlines federal government efforts to address areas of concern. AV 4.0 establishes U.S. government principles organized around three core interests and their components. The first principle is protect users and communities. AV technologies are not yet advanced enough to enable wide-scale deployment of fully autonomous vehicles. As development continues in the years ahead, the federal government's areas of focus in protecting users and communities will be to number one, prioritize safety. Safety must always be number one, and it is at the U.S. Department of Transportation. Number two, we've got to emphasize security, especially cybersecurity. And number three, we've got to address public's concerns about increasing mobility and accessibility and ensure number three is ensure privacy and also data security the number two principle is to promote efficient markets it should not be the role of the federal government to pick winners or losers so principle number two entails number one remaining technology neutral. Two, 
protecting American innovation and creativity by protecting intellectual property. Three, modernizing all these different regulations. Regulations are needed, but when they become obsolete, irrelevant, outdated, they need to be changed. The third principle is to facilitate coordinated efforts. And we do this through number one, promoting consistent standards and policies. And two, to ensure a consistent federal approach. And number three, to improve transportation system level effects. As stated in the report's cover letter, the landscape for AV innovation is complex and evolving. But the goals are pretty simple. They're clear and consistent. They need to improve safety, security, and the quality of life for all Americans. That's the barometer for success. And that will be the result of these and other transportation initiatives and innovations currently underway.